Okay, this is a, well, a recently completed project. I started it well over a year ago. Um, and then as you can see, it is the time, the current time, 4.16. And it's made up of the six and a half, I think six and a half inch, um, seven segment displays from SparkFun. And the uh, seven segment displays don't have the, the colons for a clock like this. And so I kind of lucked out because one of the colons, well, one of the decimal points, broke off in shipment. And when I told SparkFun about it, they had me take a picture and they gave me another one for free. And so I, I but I thought that the decimal point worked better as a colon. And so I took off one from the other side as well. So the top and bottom digits don't have decimal points. So here's the clock and it is powered by a propeller chip and a bunch of shift registers. Here's the shift registers on the back. And yeah, those look like the high um, high current versions, so they, they sync current only. And then the propeller chip is on this little board right there underneath those wires. There's the propeller chip. And I have a couple um, switching power regulators on there for the 3.3 volts and the 5 volts. And then I'm running it off right now with a light pole battery, um, which is running about 12 volts. And so the 12 volts actually goes to the LEDs that are throughout the run into the back of the board here. And so anyway, there's my clock. And also I have a, a countdown feature with it as well, you, so you can have it as a timer and count down in basically any other way you want numbers. I'll use it with the, my lab equipment to um, display the weight of items and probably absorption readings and things like that. Any, anything that you want numbers to display, it'll display the numbers. Um, anyway, there it is. I think it looks kind of cool. Um, and that's it.